Hello, everybody. Jake, your resident content cowboy here. Yeehaw. And Mewtwo Y has hit Aos Island. Once again, you will be heading into Mewtwo's Crystal Cave to complete this event. Heading over to the Crystal Cave Exchange once you have 100 cave coins and you will be able to get Mewtwo Y. Why? Because I said so. Here we are inside the Crystal Cave and I'm going to show you exactly what it costs to buy Mewtwo here from day one. As you saw with Mewtwo X, there really isn't a reason that you have to pick it up on day one. It's still going to be extremely powerful once you are able to unlock this Pokemon for free by completing your missions. Let me show you how to do that. First off, every day you get one die for logging in. So you log in, you roll a die, and then you can roll again if you would like by paying a certain number of coins. Just to show you exactly how this works at the start, I'm gonna be paying coins to increase the size of my rolls. This isn't something you necessarily need to do, but if you get a very, very low roll, you can pay coins to have it re-roll, and it will always be a slightly higher number. This means I will guarantee myself a six as I move across the map right here. You have the option of heading to path one or path two. Path two has a slightly higher chance of being more cave coins, so I'm going to take that direction. Head on over to my tile missions right here and then you can complete these inside of a match or you can complete these by paying gems i will be completing these by paying gems and i'll let you know how much it costs me here at the end a few things to notice inside the captain login event there is a free die that you get every single day for three days right here so make sure you claim those as you're going to unlock mewtwo y also at the home screen here if you head down to the panic parade you can see that they do have the ability to buy dies here in the Panic Parade point shop. This should be back tomorrow, so you can use the Panic Parade to get you more dies to unlock more chances to get Mewtwo a little faster. Now, on to juicing this with real money. Let's go. And there you have it. I now have unlocked Mew2Y here from the shop, and I'm gonna go ahead and play it inside of a game, post some videos here about it. As you can see, I believe it cost me somewhere around 1,300 coins. Let me actually take a look here. I think it cost me less gems because I did a few things early. Hold on here, Mew2Y. Okay, I took a look here. It cost me just under 1,000 gems. If you only just complete the map really, really quick, it will cost you more around 1,120 gems. But again, if you play this for a couple days, it will cost you quite a bit less. So as the question as to whether or not you should spend the gems, that depends on how quickly you want to unlock this Pokemon. Also, if you want to play for free and then spend some gems to unlock it, you can unlock this Pokemon much, much cheaper if you just wait a few days and use all the dies that the game gives you inside of the quests. There you have it. Mewtwo Y is here. Yeehaw to you and yours. Mm -hmm.